My name is Brant Garrison. I'm the owner of Garrison Tile and Renovation in Burley, Idaho. I've been in the tile industry for a little over 20 years now. Our next step, I have the measurements written down for where the soapbox is, and then we'll cut that piece out. And with a little bit of trimming, that will become the back of our soapbox. And we'll cut some filler pieces through the sides that will wedge it into the back. So we have these ribs all cut and made, and now we're gonna scribe them into the floor. I have a line here on the wall where the, this top corner needs to be. When I cut these, I cut them with slope on them already. So they're automatically sloped. I just need to get them to sit plumb on the face, which will give me identical slope on the top, but I need to scribe it into the floor so that all these are sitting on the floor. See what I'm talking about. I've gone and I've drilled holes in the backside in each one of the cavities to allow for moisture yes. um, due to condensation or moisture migrating through the concrete slab. I don't want it to be able to get stuck in here because these will be watertight boxes. That way we don't have a mold problem in the future. And then we're gonna put some insulation in to help with condensation because the shower will get warm, this cavity will be colder, new air condensing in there.
I am floating, I'm pushing my level, which I'm using as a screed, and that's establishing a flat plane here that slopes from up there at a quarter inch per foot down to the drain. So now that our dry pack is set up, we can remove this plug that I put in here to pull that or keep the dry pack from getting in where my linear drain will go. So we're ready to install our sheet membrane on the floor. I'm gonna start off by keying in my substrate with the flat edge of my trowel. I just make sure that we get that pin set into the surface and then we'll notch it out all in one direction. And then we'll roll the membrane out and smooth out all the air bubbles. Now we're going to dry fit this piece. We'll install inside corners and our pieces of banding around the perimeter and then we will install sheet membrane onto the shower floor. We get a bit of adhesion and are smearing that thin set down into the fibers of the fleece. You're gonna do whatever you want to do. Just go and then go.